how do we justify such wanton orchestration of factually untenable narrative and mark the timing this also an wholesome misadventure india is having a moment of glory భారత పార్లమెంట్లో విపక్ష నేతల మైక్లను నిలిపేశారంటూ బ్రిటన్ పర్యటనలో కాంగ్రెస్ అగ్రనేత రాహుల్ గాంధీ చేసిన వ్యాఖ్యలపై ఉపరాష్ట్రపతి జగదీప్ ధన్కర్ మండిపడ్డారు ప్రపంచమంతా భారత చారిత్రాత్మక విజయాలను ప్రశంసిస్తున్న వేళ కొందరు పార్లమెంటేరియన్లు అనాలోచిత వ్యాఖ్యలతో మన దేశ ప్రతిష్టను మంటగలుపుతున్నారంటూ విమర్శించారు as never before and its upward growth trajectory is unstoppable we are certainly on our way to 2047 young minds who are before us some of us may not be around at that time but the warriors of 2047 who are in their 20s and 30s must not get despair from us they must get positive directional approach from us how ironical how painful how excruciating pain people like him can feel the world is applauding our historic accomplishments and functional vibrant democracy some amongst us including parliamentarians in overdrive are engaged in thoughtless unfair denigration of our well nurtured democratic values how do we justify such wanton orchestration of factually untenable narrative and mark the timing this also an wholesome misadventure india is having a moment of glory being president of g20 and there are people outside from the country working in overdrive to denigrate us such misplaced campaign mode to taint and tarnish our parliament and constitutional entities is too serious and exceptional exceptional to be ignored and countenanced friends no political strategy or partisan stance can justify compromising our nationalism and democratic values i am before a noble soul my silence on this misadventure if i observe silence on this orchestration by a member parliament outside the country which is ill premised and wholesome motivated i would be on the wrong side of constitution it will be constitutional culpability and outrage of my oath how can i sanctify a statement that mics in indian parliament are put off how dare anyone pick up carriage to say so has there has there been ever illustration yes we did have a dark chapter of our political history proclamation of emergency the darkest period which any democracy can suffer the indian democratic polity has now matured there can be no repeat of that anyone who says so inside the country or outside that in the indian parliament mics are put off is an affront to the nation imagine this being done after having held the floor for nearly 50 minutes such kind of wanton misadventure to run down our democratic fabric and values cannot be countenanced i call upon everyone intelligence and media and youth who are warriors of 2047 rise to the occasion 
expose these forces, neutralize them. I am not a stakeholder in politics. I don't engage in partisan stance, but I do believe in constitutional duty. And I know fear cannot dominate my mind after I have kept Dr. Singh on my right side for so long. 